guys and welcome to Brooklyn, New York. It is early morning and I am going to Dumbo right now, which stands for down under the Manhattan Bridge overpass. It's really, really popular with Instagrammers, especially early in the morning at this time for sunrise. Get some really cool shots of the Manhattan Bridge um, from the ground view. So it looks really cool and you can actually see the, I think it's the Chrysler building or the, one of the other buildings, excuse me, through the bridge. It looks really cool. We're gonna get some shots there and then we're gonna walk around, maybe go to Brooklyn Heights um, and see if we can have some coffee and shoot those old houses out there that look really nice. After that, we're gonna walk over into Manhattan and we're gonna go to B&H Photo and do a bunch of other stuff too. I mean, we're in New York City, right? The, the world is at our fingertips. We can do absolutely whatever we want and we're gonna do that. But right now I gotta go. I gotta go catch the sunrise at the Manhattan Bridge. By the way, I'm filming this vlog on the iPhone 11 Pro if you didn't already know. I am doing that and it's an amazing camera, so I hope you guys like the footage that you see here. We've just about made it, but oh my gosh, it's so loud down here. Underneath the bridge, it's like, there's so much happening. There's construction and there's a train that goes over and it just shakes the whole thing and it's, it's super, super loud, man. Disturbing the morning peace. <laughs> We made it, hey, check it out. It's pretty cool. This is the uh, ever so famous Dumbo. It's popular in the morning and in the afternoons because look, you can see the Brooklyn Bridge, sorry, the Manhattan Bridge through these, through this really cool street. So some really cool shots. I got the uh, 70 to 200 out. I'm gonna take some shots with this, see if we can get some cool looks. A lot of Instagrammers are out this morning, out in full force. All right, I got some pretty decent shots here, so now I'm gonna head down to the water and get some shots there on the waterfront. Really, really beautiful here in the morning on the waterfront, so hopefully we can get some good Good looking shots. So I was here in this area the other night trying to catch the sunset, which didn't go as planned. It was overcast, but it was packed. There were so many people out here just enjoying the afternoon and just having some drinks and hanging out and their kids were playing and like there was just everybody people from all walks of life and i love that about new york you know it's so like interesting there's so many different types of people here and um they're all doing different things and they all have their own way of living their lives and it's awesome so uh yeah especially in brooklyn brooklyn's pretty cool so unfortunately as as cool as this area is during the sunrise Actually, the sun is rising over there. So in terms of shooting this way, you're not getting that interesting of lighting scenarios. If you come here at sunset, when the light is, is setting behind these buildings behind me, you get much more interesting and complex lighting. And that leads to a much cooler image in my opinion. That doesn't mean that it's not cool, you know, to be out here. I mean, there's definitely still plenty of shots to be had early in the morning and there's nobody out here at this time. And that's one of the reasons why I love it. But I would love if just today, the sun would rise on the other side of the river. That would be pretty cool. And as I say that, the light reflects off this tower and hits the water. And see, that's the reflection on the water that we love, which you would get more of if the sun was setting over there. So this is one of my favorite neighborhoods in New York City. It's called Brooklyn Heights. And uh, as you can see, it's lovely. It's peaceful, it's quiet, it's beautiful. And look at these homes, they're so old. Yeah, just a cool place to explore if you're ever in New York City and you want a little peace and quiet. This neighborhood is definitely something to check out. I 
where we found some coffee. So I am gonna step in here and get some. But that's enough wandering in this part of town. I'm gonna hop on a bike, cycle over the Brooklyn Bridge, and uh, see what Manhattan has to offer. Let's go. Guys, we made it. So for those of you that don't know what b &H Photo is, it is the premier photography shop in America, online and as you can see here, in person. They have everything you could ever want related to photography, videography, audio, So that was pretty cool. Got this nice little selfie stick. Get some high quality vlog content with the iPhone. Um, so I have no plans today, so I'm just gonna walk down to the waterfront and then maybe walk all the way up uptown. But I guess we'll have to see. So this is the part of the city where you can buy all of your fake watches and purses and Pretty much all the fake stuff made in China, you can buy it here. I love that people have cut holes in the fence here so you can see through. So we made it, but it's way too early. So I gotta wait like, probably like an hour until the sun peaks back behind those buildings. Um, but you know what, that's cool. I'll hang out up here. It's kind of loud. The train tracks are right behind me, but gotta get the shot, man. Gotta get the shot. Well, I would say that was a mission success. We got some really cool photos there. Um, the sun, I mean, it wasn't perfect, but hey, we worked with what we had, and uh, I think we came away with some pretty good shots. I'm super excited to get home and edit those. You guys have probably already seen them. But anyways, thanks for joining me today, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, I'm really impressed with the camera on this thing, on the iPhone 11 Pro. I mean, it's amazing. This whole vlog was shot with this camera, completely handheld no extra stabilization. And um, I think it looked pretty good from what I've seen so far today, just first impressions, it looks amazing. So I guess when we edit, if this vlog is released, I'm, I'm pretty satisfied. If it's not released, well, it sucks, but I think it's gonna be released. I'm pretty happy with, with what we've got today. So I'm gonna go get some food. It's getting late, I'm pretty tired. Getting up at sunrise every day is not an easy thing to do. I'm gonna go get some food get in bed and get ready for tomorrow. Thanks again guys and I will see you soon.